Hello, my name is Ben Parker. I'm a fourth year kinesiology student at the University of Regina, majoring in human kinetics, and I completed my fieldwork practicum at Adrenaline Strength and Conditioning in Regina, Saskatchewan. Adrenaline Strength and Conditioning is a warehouse gym that is home to a variety of training types, including strongman, powerlifting, athlete and team training, group fitness classes, and spin classes, just to name a few. Included within the gym is a certified nutritional therapy consultant, a massage therapist, certified trainers and coaches that allow the gym to offer as many services as possible. Derek Becker is a certified national strength and conditioning coach with over 15 years of experience teaching. Deanna Wells is the head sports performance coach that oversees all the team and athlete training. Jill Hansen is the head of all the group fitness classes and teaches on the side to provide her expertise to allow all members to reach their goals. When I first started, I wanted the videos to simply be a variety of exercises because adrenaline offers all types of training. And as I went through working on this project, I decided to film exercises that I believed would be the most beneficial for the members. I wanted to make quality videos rather than quantity, so every video will provide an abundance of information in regards to proper form and technique, things to watch out for, and safety tips to ensure maximum efficiency and minimize the risk of injury. Farmer's walks is a great exercise that helps with training grip, provide all around stability, and increasing postural strength. Good mornings help create a strong engagement of the posterior chain that help the spinal stabilizers to prevent spinal flexion. Reverse hyperextensions are a great exercise designed to help load the glutes and hamstrings while keeping the lower back safe. Standing calf raises help with overall stability, reducing stress on the Achilles, and decreasing the risk of ankle and knee injuries. These are exercises that I believed are needed to be included within the gym's library of exercises. Looking back on this project, I wish that I would have filmed more exercises that were specific to some of the services that are offered. For example, filming more exercises that deal with strongman competitions and get some of the athletes involved in showcasing different exercises that are specific to their sport. Overall, I really enjoyed working on this project and I'm excited for people to properly learn all of these movements.